Hi everyone. In this video I want to show you the main advantage of using a virtual set for your educational broadcast. When a course is created by using a virtual set, it will look much more appealing. The students will find the course more interesting and this will result in higher grades. For example, you can use 3D graphics of fish during your biology course to show the wide variety of the species. This will help the students understand the teacher better and visualize the course. There is so much equipment on the market. If a school would like to have the same effect as a TV station, they often have to purchase professional products designed for professional users and TV stations. These products are difficult to operate, very complex and very expensive. Data Video TVS series equipment is developed and designed specifically for the educational market. It is easy to operate and can be obtained at a reasonable price with a high cost performance ratio. A machine very suitable for use in school and very easy to learn. Actually, it is very easy to create your own virtual background. Let me show you how you can use TVS series equipment to create various virtual backgrounds for educational purposes via a few simple steps. You can use a real scene photo taken by someone as the background and then add a few photo objects with the background keyed out to it. Furthermore, you can also place a table in the foreground and in this way we can create a chemistry lab from nothing to a fully equipped lab. Or you can create layers of hand-drawn pictures and then put on objects required for the course so that you can allow many more variations of the background style and thus enriching the lecture contents. In addition to the pictures, TVS series equipment also allows video to be used as the background so that the lecture becomes more appealing. Of course, 3D virtual backgrounds are the most useful and provide the most varieties. On datavideovirtualset.com there are many professional 3D virtual sets to choose from. You are allowed to download the trial version for free. If you find one that is suitable for your application, you can make your purchase on the website and download the official version. Next, let's start making the course video on your TVS series equipment. First of all, import the virtual set that you've just purchased. Start filming and recording after the teacher is properly positioned in the studio. The TVS 1000 can be expanded with an aux card. Connecting an Apple TV to that aux card gives you the option to use an iPad during your classes. First, insert the auxiliary card in the TVS 1000 and then connect the Apple TV to the extra HDMI input. Now you can use Wi-Fi to project your tablet's presentation on the virtual set background screen. In this way, it will be very easy for the teacher to show presentations and slideshows. You can hold your tablet in your hands during the class or you can use a specialized tablet holder. Downstream key a graphic desk on the foreground to make the scene look more realistic. Of course, you can also place the tablet on a real desk. TVS 1000 and a tablet are perfect companions in classes. In addition, RMC 220 offers useful hotkey features. We can assign at most 10 sets of animations to the hotkeys. This is sufficient to meet the lecture requirement. The objective is to activate the preset background and animation to appear at different key points. This enhances the lecture contents and gives a little extra to the course. In this way, the students will be able to better understand the concepts that the teacher is trying to convey. These cool foreground animation effects can be created using 3ds Max, After Effects or other animation editors and then converted to TVS compatible files. In addition to the above mentioned functions, TVS series equipment also offers different virtual camera movements such as pan, tilt and zoom. This will create a more appealing program. It's definitely the powerful tool for the teacher during a lecture. 